before I get to the questions, make a quick statement. Uh, congratulations to Kansas uh, for their win. Um, uh, obviously, a uh, hard fought, fought battle. Um, we did some things that I thought were, were pretty good, but there's some other things that we need, definitely uh, need to improve on. But I have to give a lot of credit to Kansas, what they're doing defensively and what they've done offensively to, to get the win. Obviously, the thing that stands out the most is whenever you give, a, give up turnovers like that and you don't get them yourself, then it's tough to win games, let alone only lose by, what, 11 points or so. So, uh, uh, And it's tough to turn the ball over, but then have it be scores on the other side. So I believe it's a fumble return for a touchdown and a pick six that cost us. And we had another um, interception when we, uh, I think we crossed midfield at that point. So, um, you know, got to take care of the football better. We had uh, another ball on the ground, and, and it's just as simple as ball security. Got to do better than that, and, and that's my job as a coach to get us ready for that. And, uh, we had some mistakes that, that happened on, on all three phases. It wasn't just one side, but uh, you can't give a, a team like Kansas that many opportunities and that many uh, freebies in terms of what we can control. So. Speaking of what we can control is to get on to the next one, learn from this, get better. Uh, I, I'm, I'm proud of the guys' effort and the, the fight in the game. Uh, obviously, uh, we had our moments and uh, just need to put it together consistently for 60, 60 minutes. And that wasn't good enough for the win, but um, you know, try to make it close towards the end and, and give Kansas a lot, of, a lot of credit. I think they were able to figure some things out and run the, run the ball and uh, we're get, get some yards and convert some third downs. Um, on our side, we need to get better. We need to find ways to get more stops and get the ball back to our offense and then take care of the football offensively. Um, make sure we don't make the mistakes that, that we've been making and, and uh, move on to the next one. So uh, I told the guys I was proud of them, uh, proud of their effort. Um, but you know, th there's no consolation prize when you're doing this. I, that, that's expected of them. So uh, my job as a coach is to make sure that we're, we're ready to roll. A uh, quick week, so that, that's good. We, we don't have to wait another day. So we get to the next game. Uh, next week at home, looking forward to being being at home and playing that game. And, uh, you know, we'll learn from this, but get better as well. So what questions do you guys have? Yeah, well, I mean, he scrambled the first. Is that one that you talk about? Yeah. Scrambled the first down. Yeah, uh, the two two choices are to bring more pressure and, and uh, but you know, I, I don't, I don't, I think we're planning on on Jalen getting rid of the ball in the timing route, and he didn't do it. Instead, he he tucked it and ran and got the first down. That's game of football. I mean, sometimes you're going to bring a lot of heat. Sometimes you drop eight, and and if you have a really good quarterback like Jalen does, and then he he makes you pay for it. So uh, I'll let Jake explain that one. But that's that's. I've done that before too, so it's okay. I, I, um, we just needed the stops when it counted. That was one play where you needed that ball back, and um, yeah, there's 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 enough mistakes to go around. That, that and I, I don't know if that was the one, but, but it was a key point. We just with everything that's happened, you know, we we uh, looking at the yards and the plays and everything like that. That this is kind of like the flip side. How how do they win by that that score? Is because we spotted them some points and didn't take care of the football and. And didn't get off the field enough. So, um, but credit to, to Kansas. I thought a really talented team, and we, I've been saying that all week. And uh, I, I really like uh, Lance Leipold. I think he's a, he's an amazing coach, and he's done a great job with his program. And, and you can see that they play hard. We we can see it on film, and we felt that today. And, and we have some guys that are banged up, and I think they do too. And that's once you get in the conference play, that's going to be the name of the game. We we had to dip into our our depth a little bit, and we might have to for next week. But. Uh, I don't know. No, nobody from what I know, nobody's out for this season yet. So we'll, we'll hopefully get those guys back. But until then, we just we got to depend on the guys that we have that are fresh and ready to roll. Yeah, if I had the answer for that, I would tell you guys. Maybe you guys can let me know. But uh, it, it, it's probably a combination of just getting the guys' confidence back, and then you know I, I think a lot of teams are trying to take the run away from us, which is fine. If they do that, we got to make them pay, and that's that's throw the ball in the air and. and when you throw the ball in the air, you got to take care of the football. You can't you can't uh, throw interceptions and, and can't take sacks. And I thought Kansas' game, game plan was to take the run away, and they, they did that, and then uh, try to make big plays on, on defense with sacks and interceptions. And 
Um, you know, and they, they got that early fumble return for a touchdown. Big plays by them. We didn't make enough plays to, to counter it, and um, that's the game of football that happens. And I got to do a better job and make sure our guys are are on the better side of things that we would have been better positioned to have success. Why do you think the illegal touching Yeah, it's it. You know, we check with the refs every play, so I, I don't know what to tell you. This one is like that. That's been the one that we kept got to keep. Uh, and I, it's on the play with the cut block too, right? So uh, I, I don't know. I, th I thought Dion was protecting the quarterback in the, on a blitz and said there was outside the the tackle box. The, the entire line did a full slide. So I don't know if he was or not. I I gotta watch the film, but I the refs the, the, they they see it. And they call it how they see it. So we got to do a better job. And I mean, we had a, a interception that was taken away because of a hold. That's just the game. You gotta you gotta find ways to not make those mistakes and 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 find ways to make plays. So. We didn't do that well enough, and and that's that's my job. Did you feel like it was a missed opportunity coming here and again? I felt so, yeah. But that, I mean, you can only cry about it for so long, you know. We've got. Uh, um, I, I don't know how many of you guys thought we'd be in this position right now, but I don't really care. My thing is to get our team ready to go and and make sure we learn from this. I uh, I know that we have a, a good team. I know that we haven't played our best yet. I'm looking forward to doing that next week. We definitely didn't play our best t today, and. and um, you can either sulk about it or complain or, or just get better. And that I choose to get get this team better for next week. I think we got a little bit behind too, but um, it seemed like the the run game was, was it was tough sledding, you know. So the, um, the if the pass game's there, let's take it. But I'd like to see us get the ball in the end zone. I think they forced us to kick some field goals instead of getting the end zone. Then we didn't definitely take care of the football. It's hard when you give a, a pick six for a touchdown and then a fumble return for a touchdown. That's hard on our defense and hard on the morale of the team. I don't, I don't want to blame it on the offense, but we, we pride ourselves on taking care of the football. So we got to take care of the football on offense and then on defense, got to find ways to create havoc and get some get get some turnovers ourselves. We didn't do we didn't do enough as a team. It's a complete team loss. Um, well, I, I think on the, you know, look, looking at some of the plays that happened, I mean, the, we, we definitely made mistakes. We weren't lined up right. And then it just, they, they were committed to trying to run the ball down our throat and we had to stop them sometime. And, and we gave them too many yards and, and allowed them to get, get in field goal range. And then they, they went up by two scores. I, I think the plan was to get a stop and uh, you have to give them credit. I, I thought Kansas had a really good game plan and we knew that they're a dangerous team. Uh, that they can run the ball with a, a number of, of running backs and uh, and that the quarterback can run himself. And then there's a physical line. I th thought they played a great game as far as taking care of the football themselves. And then uh, they were able to execute. You know, we, we, we just uh, didn't do enough. That, that's how, the only thing I can explain. And, but you can't, say, you can't take anything away from Kansas. I, I, th I thought Coach Leipold and his staff did a great job getting ready for this game. And did a better job than we did. Last two questions. Yeah, we have no choice. Uh, we, we feel really good about the talent on our team. So some guys will be on the field uh, th that, that we weren't expecting. I mean, we got guys that were knocked out of this game, and, and we'll get some guys back. But um, we, we, have, we have enough talent. That's why we went to the portal. That's why we try to develop our young guys. And so we feel good about our talent that we have. And, and uh, you know, we, we have to have these guys ready to go by the time we, we face Cincinnati on Friday. Your initial assessment, just the, the first taste of Big 12 play, yeah, we can play in this conference. I, I think if you talk to, you know, Kansas State, they'll tell you that. It just, we just didn't help ourselves with this one. And and, and I, again, uh, I say that with all respect to Kansas and their team. Uh, I would like to see us play cleaner uh, on our side, but uh, you have to give them a lot of credit. I think they 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 were create enough havoc and make, and stress us a, a little bit in all three phases, and cause us some issues. And that's why they came away with the 11 point win. All right, thank you. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it.